Hi, this is Sir Romy again. Yesterday we discussed the multiplication of binomials by using algebra tiles. Now, we will uh, do the reverse process. We have to factor polynomials using these algebra tiles. Okay, but before that, uh, I'll give you an inspirational message. Every day may not be good, but there is something good in every day. By Alice Morris Earl. Okay, so let's start now. We have the x squared tile here, the white one, the bigger one. We have the negative x squared tile, the gray color. We have here the positive x tile, the longer rectangle. We have the negative x tile, then the, the gray one. We have the unit tile, the white is the positive, and the gray is the negative unit tile. Now let's start. We will use this in our process. Let's, for example, we will factor 2x squared plus 7x plus 6. Okay, we will factor this trinomial. What will we do? We will collect 2 positive x, 2 positive x squared, I mean, then 7 positive x we have 7 5 6 7 then we have 6 positive okay, we'll use this 6 uh, positive tiles now what will we do we have to arrange them okay to make a perfect box we will arrange them let's try okay we can arrange them let's try then Okay, perfect. So we had arranged them. Now we will find the factors. Since this is the longer one, we have to put here another one. Positive, positive, okay. So let's just uh, measure the sides. Then another one here. Another one here, another one here, another one, and another one. So perfect. We have completed the factors. So what will be the factors? Let us count. 1, 2, 2, x positive plus 3. Then the other side, 1x plus so this would be your final answer okay next okay another one x squared minus x minus 12 so this is your trinomial now what will we do we have to collect the tiles 1x squared negative x the gray one and negative 12 we have negative gray unit tiles we have 12 2 4 6 8 10 11 12 so we have negative 12 unit tiles negative x only one and 1x squared, the white one. Now, what will we do? Will it be possible? Can we form? No. It's impossible. The unit tiles must always be at the bottom. So, we cannot make it. How will we form a perfect box? No. So what will we do? 
then we have to add neutral pairs neutral pairs neutral pairs okay let's try can we make it here the neutral pairs yes another one one more neutral pair another one we'll put it here and we'll put it here so it's perfect it can form a perfect box so what is your answer X must be at the top white and since this is positive we have to put another white here white and white positive times positive will become positive then negative here negative times positive will become negative 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 and negative negative times positive will become negative okay that's correct it's correct okay next uh, if we put the negative here negative times negative will become positive so this must be positive 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 let's check positive times positive will become positive positive times negative will become negative the same all throughout here positive times positive will become positive correct all throughout positive times negative will become negative all throughout so we had formed the factors of this polynomial okay let's check our answer will be 1x and three positive unitiles 1x and negative four unitiles so this is it